In this video, we will work around HTML introduction and overview. With that, we will also see how we can create our first HTML document that is the HTML web page. Let's begin. So guys, there are mainly three pillars of web development. If you want to begin learning web development, you need to go for HTML, CSS and JavaScript. So HTML is a markup language. It's hypertext markup language. Right now you can see the stats from w3text.com that more than 94% of websites use HTML. With that, I just said markup language. So markup language is a standard are basically rules that provides information in a document that is in the form of actual content. So how this content is visible in the document, how it is human readable using tags. So we use tags to give the structure to a web page using HTML. So I just told you about the HTML tags. Basically HTML elements are described by these tags. Okay. If you have seen any heading on a web page or any paragraph on a web page, it is enclosed. It is started and ended by these tags. Let's say so we use angle brackets for the tags. H1 is for heading one. If you want to create heading one, you can use H1 tag. P tag is for paragraph. Strong is for bold. In this way, we have a lot of tags available in HTML. Okay. So these HTML elements and tags are considered as the building blocks of HTML pages. That means the web browsers use these elements and tags to display content on a web page in the form of heading, paragraph, bold text, list, unordered list, ordered list, text and others. Okay. These tags are visible while you are coding HTML, but when you'll see the result on a web page, these tags won't be visible. Only the result will be visible with that. Then came HTML5 to enhance the features of HTML. Okay. So it introduced in the year 2014. It provides more multimedia support so that it helps you in creating better user interface for a website. Okay. It brings new APIs and it is actually considered as a blessing for the developers, the HTML developers, the UA developers so that they can easily extend the functionality of a website using the new tags and supported features like canvas and all. So now guys, after the introduction and overview, we will now create an HTML document. That means uh, how we can create a first web page with HTML for creating an HTML document an HTML web page for coding it. You need notepad plus plus or you can even code on notepad. We'll be using notepad plus plus. So it's similar. You can use any one of them. Okay. The file name extensions for any HTML document uh, will be dot HTML or dot HTM. We'll be using dot HTML. You can see and we'll be using notepad plus plus. You can also go for notepad. I'm repeating again. So you can save this extension file dot HTML extension file file anywhere on your system C drive D drive E drive desktop. So we will do the same and now we will be starting with the, how we can create an HTML document. In this video, we'll be learning about how we can create an HTML document. This video is basically for those who want to start learning about HTML. So in an HTML document. First, you need to add doc type declaration, which is like this. So you need to always add it. This is important and always remember when you are creating an HTML document, the first thing you need to add is doc type declaration. Then we will add the HTML tag. Remember every HTML tag you need to close it. If you're opening it, except some some like BR HR tag, you don't need to close them. So for every open tag, you need to close it HTML. Then you need to add the head part. Then you need to close the head part. Head part will have the title. I hope you know what is a title. If you don't know, then I'll let you know. After closing the head tag, you need to add the body tag. And you need to close it. So every HTML document has head part and a body part. These are the two parts. Now let's add a title. Let's add first program in HTML and save it. So here I have created a folder on the D drive Amit thinks. Now I'll save it to one. You can add any name and the format you can add it HTML. Select it HTML dot HTML is the extension. You can also add dot HTM. So I'll save it. Okay. So here you can see one dot HTML is saved under D Amit thinks one dot HTML. Now I'll run it. I have reached the folder here. Here is one dot HTML. I'll just double click it or open it in the browser of my choice. So I'll open it in, it in Firefox browser. So 
so here you can see the file is visible you can easily create an HTML document on your local system here first program in HTML is visible which was the title so title is visible here now moving further now we will add the body text under body text to add a contained you need to know you need to add the paragraph tag here let's add welcome to Amit things and that's it save it again control s now let's refresh it here you can see welcome to Amit things is visible so in the same way you can create HTML document and begin with it like this in the upcoming videos I'll be telling you how to create a heading how to add paragraphs how to create a table in HTML and other things about HTML thank you for watching the video